Alright, so we're going to be tying a pretty simple fly here. Uh, this is a guide's choice hare's ear basically, but tied on a jigged hook with a tungsten bead on it. And so we're going to be starting out with a size 16 Orvis Tactical Barbless Hook. And on there, I've got a 332nd uh, slotted tungsten bead. A little later in the season like this, a bit smaller of a fly with a little bit less weight to it is kind of key. Has a little bit softer of a landing and won't spook fish in skinny water. I'm using 70 denier thread here. So to start out, I'm going to strip off 10 or 15 pheasant tail fibers. And I'm going to tie them in about a half hook shank in length off the back there. And I'll wrap that up solid to form a nice little body and just break those off. Next I'm going to be tying in some small red wire. I don't think the color matters as much. I think just getting some segmentation in there is kind of key. So for the body on this, I'm going to be using Crystal Hair's Ear Dub. It's basically just standard Hair's Ear Dubbing with a little bit of flash added into it, which I absolutely love. So you're going to take and kind of build a tapered dubbing noodle on your thread there. And then you'll take and bring that forward and kind of build up a nice evenly tapered body. Bring it up to just in front of the hook point there. Pull off all that excess. And then we'll take and wrap that wire through. Tie that off and then just helicopter it on out. So for the thorax, I'm going to be using some Peacock Black Ice Dub. You could use Peacock Curl here, but I personally like using this. It's a little more durable. You just want to build up a nice little thorax right there. It doesn't have to be even really. So next I'm going to come in with a little partridge feather. We're going to do a soft hackle collar. So I'll take and find the tip of that feather in there. And I'll tie that off and try to get it to kind of slide into that slot in the tungsten bead back there. And I'll take and come in and snip out that tip. And we'll come in. Make a, try to get a full wrap out of it on the collar. And just kind of keep on preening it back. You can kind of catch that stem there. Get in and snip it on out. And then to finish it off, I'll take a little pinch of that same peacock black ice stub and just form a tiny little bit on the thread there. And then take and grab all those partridge fibers and kind of stroke them back and put a nice little collar on there. 
and then I'll whip finish her off and with this orange thread here it forms a nice little hot spot up there at the head of the fly and then just put a little drop of some head cement in there let that soak in that's how you tie a guide's choice hair's ear on a jigged hook